all right we're we're at the right now we are at the infamous spot where the grime sisters bodies were found at nighttime on the side of the road I'm gonna show you show you where their bodies were found this spot this spot is is proclaimed to be haunted somewhere their bodies were found somewhere around here originally when I first filmed this in uh, the daytime my search was over there on the on the right side of the guardrail right side of the road I should say since uh, th this this particular road has guardrails because of, there's a creek below called Devil's Creek as you can see you can hear water moving that would be Devil's Creek I mean, the reason I'm showing you this part of the guard guardrail because some guy who was doing the same invest same uh, documentary of haunted places filmed on this side of the guard on uh, this side of the road I should say <clears throat> on this side of the road and I'm not sure which exactly is the right the right 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 spot. But it's either here or here, there. Either way, I'm at the right spot. I, I know it for sure. Okay, and I'm on the other side of the road right now. <clears throat> and we're, we're going to investigate another place that's proclaimed to be haunted. You see this place this other place we're about to go to is uh is this is this old is the location of this former house that used that used to be here dur during the time of the murder but ever since the bodies were f their bodies were found that people start started investigating from left to right and stuff like that and for some for some reason for some reason the 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 family just abandoned their home there's a lot of theories what why they would do that either the police confiscated the man and he felt felt embarrassed and just wanted to leave or something really horrible something really awful happened in that exact spot Either way, we're gonna check it out. This spot is right is right next to. This, I mean, coincidentally, this this uh, uh, house was located right next to the, to the area where the Grime Sisters' bodies were found. And I also uh, heard something on the internet about a about some some website set said that uh that the Grime sisters haunt haunt this property or something I have no idea I mean there's a lot there's people saying a lot of things and stuff like that well here's a here's a look at the here's one of the gates of the of the old house Strangely enough, it has a mailbox. Hmm. Well, anyways. 
we're now approaching County Line Road, which is which is just about 50 feet from the from the spot spot where the Grime Sisters were found. And uh, the, we're we're approaching County Line Road right now, and we're gonna visit this spot where the house was at. I'm not sure if we're going to see any ghosts today, but who knows. I tried taking pictures of this, of the, of the mur, of the murder spot, but my camera just kept focusing and unfocusing and just, just worrying and was kind of annoying. <sighs> well, let me tell you about more about the house. Over time, when after the family abandoned the property, it just remained like that for quite a while. And uh, then, and then the, and then there was a, there was like an old car that used to be be on that property, just sitting there abandoned. And there used to be people who went up to that. To the house and check it out. Check it out. There used to be people that checked out the house and uh, and found out all the stuff was abandoned and stuff like that. Well, the car the car that used to be there it was there it was there for a while and then it just disappeared. I'm not exactly sure if the owner like reclaim this car or somebody stole the car but I have no idea over time as time went by the the house remained abandoned of course but then one day some vandalists set, set fire to the property set the house on fire and the house pretty much burnt was was all burnt remains the owner, owner sa sadly just tore down the burnt remains and, and all that is left is the driveway, an outhouse, and of course these poles. Well, we're going to walk through the, the property now. These are the original posts when, that was like in front of their house. This is basically the main main entrance to their house. Here's remains of the old driveway that led to their house. And the gate's pretty much open. I guess we're just going to walk through. Now originally when I when I filmed uh, the German Church Road I saw this spot but I wasn't exactly sure if it was the right spot and all all there was left at the time was snow a lot of snow now you can see this most pretty much all of the snow is gone there's the Brown is a little wet.
as you can see that there, there's remains of the of the old driveway and uh, I'm not sure where I'm not sure where the original house was at a lot of weeds here Okay, here's the driveway. A lot of weeds here. As you can see, that that's a con that's a concrete driveway. Just to, to let you guys know, not a whole lot of the driveway since uh, grass grew, and uh, I mean, obviously went to complete this repair over the years, and weed has grown out of the spot. And there's not a whole lot of the road now than there was in the old days. You're not going to see uh, remains of a house because the house was burnt down a long time ago. Some, some person on the internet said the, the house mysteriously burnt down but there was another website that said vandalists burned down the house which is more acceptable and also at night people say at night I hear people on the internet say at night that you can hear a uh, like like a ghost car at night time And uh, the, the car would co come to a complete stop at first, drop something, like you would hear the, the sounds of a car coming to a complete stop, stop, drop something that off, and then just drive away. I don't know where where the driveway is anymore. Kind of lost track. But anyways, the house originally stood somewhere over there by those trees. This pl this air the spot this uh empty lot and the the germ the, the spot on German Church Road is proclaimed to be haunted. I see some of the driveway right here, but it pretty much just dis disappears. Bye.